Hi everybody, this is Carrie Ann with Apartment Aquatics and I'm just making a quick video on making Rapashi meat pie. These are the supplies that you're going to need. There's of course my Rapashi meat pie mix. I'm, I use two uh, measuring cups, one for water, one for the powder and to mix it. Then you also see my ice cube tray that I use as well as my whisk. Um, you'll also need a pan of boiling water or if you prefer to use the microwave you can. I just don't. So first I'm going to mix the 1 4th cup of powder into um, one of my measuring cups. Once I have that 1 4th done, it's actually my smaller plastic one that I do that with, I pour it into my larger glass one which I'll add the water to as well to mix it. Then of course you get your water boiling as you can see here multiple times. I just wanted to make sure we got a good picture. Once it's boiling uh, very well, I then pour three-fourths of water into my measuring cup and then I have to slowly pour it in with the powdered mix and I use the whisk to mix it up. Now be careful because it will kind of stick at the side so you have to make sure that you get all the edges. Once it's thoroughly mixed and normally it really only takes me about two minutes, I go ahead and I pour it into my ice tray. Now I use this that does the slim bars because then I can cut them up um, and use them um, basically like one bar will feed a, a lot of my juveniles. And this is the leftover. Um, for some reason I had some leftovers from my pour. I think the first few um, slots in the tray weren't as full as they could have been. Um, so I just kind of poured it on a plastic. Uh, I'll use that tonight here to feed some of my babies. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to uh, hit me up. And everybody, here is a little sneak peek. Uh, I cut some of that leftover or miscellaneous rapashi. And as you can see, they're pretty small pieces. I put them in here. The babies in this tank are some of my holdbacks. They range from 4 to uh, over 6 inches actually now. Um, as you can see, they are hunting. Um, and they are eating uh, these little rapashi pieces. Now keep in mind that nobody was harmed. <laughs> there was no limbs bitten or anything like that. This is how they get when they're hunting. Um, it is pretty, you know, pretty fun actually to watch. After I took this video, I, I continued watching for a while before I uploaded it. So, um, I don't personally hand feed every single one. I just toss it in there and they go after it.